Hey there and good evening to you. Well, the UIL has suspended all practices, rehearsals and meetings until March 29th, but they have yet to cancel any sports, including the UIL Boys State Basketball Tournament. The San Saba boys are still awaiting their turn to play in the tournament and our Mandy Knight visited with head coach Mark Kyle to find out how they're handling all of this uncertainty. Complete torture. <laughs> it's just, you have no idea when you're going to play. You have no idea anything. With the state tournament postponed until further notice, it's nearly impossible to plan for the best case scenario. If they did reinstate it, would we finish it before baseball and track? Would we finish it after? Just that right there would help because then it would give us a timetable how to schedule practices around all the other people. Speaking of practice, yesterday the UIL announced that teams are not allowed to work out after school, leaving the players responsible to practice on their own. Cannot use the school facilities and so as soon as school's out, they're out. Uh, I, I'm, I'm sure that they will make their way to the city court and uh, if it quit raining a little bit and maybe even if it rains they might be out there doing what they love to do and that's play basketball. In reality, the state tournament could very well be canceled, which is something Mark Kyle conveyed to his team. And I've already told the kids whatever situation comes out, it's not going to be perfect. It's not going to fit everybody's agenda and we're going to have to do with it just like you would during a game situation comes up, you're going to have to adjust, you're going to have to adapt, and you're going to have to find a way to get, get what you want done. Since the COVID-19 pandemic is unprecedented, Coach Kyle wants to be an example to his players that they can get through this together as a team. Why I was in the business to begin with was, you know, we want to win, we're competitors, but it was not about W's and L's, it's about life lessons and teaching. And, and this is a hard life lesson, but it is one of those. And how I meet this challenge, hopefully it'll go a long ways to showing these kids how they too can meet that challenge. Reporting for Fox 44 Sports, I'm Mandy Knight.